Hello everyone, so um, welcome back to another vlog. I wanted to start this vlog off by doing a quick little perlery um, unboxing. They were kind enough to send me a bunch of jewelry to um, try out and review. And so uh, I'm just going to quickly, it came in this little bag. Um, perlery, cute little dust bag for jewelry. And then there's a little um, postcard. Say hello to your new favorites. So cute. And then inside, um, I got a necklace and some earrings. So they come wrapped up like this. So I'm just gonna try them on for you guys. So these are the 18K gold, 18K gold plated large croissant earrings. They are tarnish free. Um, here's what they look like. How cute. I feel like um, statement hoops like this have really come back in style the past couple of years. When I was um, like in high school, it was all about skinny and big hoops. And now we're back to like very, I don't know, 80s statement hoops. Oh, how cute. These definitely look like something my mom would have worn um, in the 80s. Can't even see them because my hair keeps falling. So there's those. I feel like I should put my hair up in like a ponytail today. Um, so they're mo more visible. These actually came in like perfect time because I do have a little get together this evening. So now I can wear um, some new jewelry to my get together. There, I feel like that's really cute when you wear it. Um, with like your hair up and then you can like really see them and they're more of a statement piece. And then uh, they also sent me this necklace. And so this is the gold plated meteorite foil style necklace tarnish free. I love that like meteorite style. I'm really into like outer space um, imagery. You know, a lot of my jewelry has like moons and stars and um, whatnot. And so meteorite is cool because it's like a kind of like that same um I don't know theme but it's a little different it's not as uh common so here's what it looks like isn't that so cool it's on a thin little um chain so it'll be like dainty and pretty and then it does have like um an adjustable clasp so you can choose how long or how short you have it. All right, and there we go. Here, let's pick this up so we can maybe see it better. How beautiful, and then the earrings. All right, so thank you so much to Perlery for sending these over to me. I will leave um, a link to both of these pieces um, specifically down in the description below, as well as just a link to their website in general, um, in case you guys wanna check them out. But yeah, that's gonna be it for now. Okay, so HelloFresh box just came in. I haven't gotten one since before Thanksgiving, so I'm excited to, you know, get back to eating um, my little, healthy, easy, home-cooked vegetarian meals. Um, and then I added this as an add-on for the kids. And I'll also, I want to try them too, but they are Grand's Hot Cocoa Rolls. And I've been checking to see if these are in stores and I haven't seen them anywhere. Um, I've only seen them uh, if you get them as an extra for HelloFresh. So if you know where to buy these in stores, let me know. Um, and they have a marshmallow icing. These just sound so yummy. So we're going to do this this weekend, I think. Just some more Christmassy things. My lovely husband picked up some eggnog. I used to love eggnog, but lately I haven't been feeling it. And then the holiday blend from Starbucks. Um, K cups, so yummy. Okay, so um, I haven't been sharing, sharing a whole lot of like Christmas gifts this year, other than what I got my kids and my husband. But um, I did want to share this shirt because I just think it's really cool. I got it for my little brother because he loves Star Wars. Um, I got it from Five Below, and they had so many like cool Star Wars and Disney shirts. Um, so. I was about to wrap this 
but I thought I would share it with you guys first in case you have a Star Wars lover or like Star Wars yourself. I just think it's a cool little shirt. Okay, so we are doing Santa photos later this week, so I wanted to quickly share the kiddos' outfits. Um, and they're all like hand-me-downs and uh, or outfits from last year. So my son says, this shirt from last year, we didn't do Santa photos last year. I actually downloaded like this Etsy um, like template, and it was like Santa holding a uh, like empty photo frame, and then you could like insert your kids' photos in there. So we did that because of COVID. This year we're doing Santa photos again. Um, so he has this hand-me-down, or not hand-me-down, this shirt from last year still fits him with just some khakis. Then this shirt for my five-year-old, this was my son's, and this is one of my favorite things I've ever bought, um, any of the kids. And it's just a Christmas sweater of a dinosaur eating a reindeer, and everyone thinks it's so funny. She's got this little red and black skirt, a hand-me-down for my cousin, um, some black leggings, and then she's going to have her hair in little pigtails with these bows. They're, they don't match, but they both match the sweater. They're just not the same bow. And then these are hand-me-downs. So these my five-year-old and two-year-old wore two years ago. And so now my two-year-old's wearing my five-year-old's old one, and my seven-month-old is wearing, oh, she's going to be eight months tomorrow. I can't say seven month old anymore. Um, my eight month old is wearing the one my two year old wore two years ago. Um, and so they're just the exact same dress. I got these on Amazon. They came in a two pack also with striped ones. They have white leggings. Um, I don't know what shoes any of the other kids are gonna wear, but um, for my eight month old, she has these little shoes that she's gonna wear with it. Um, and then for bows, two year olds just gonna have her hair in a regular ponytail with this bow and then I have this headband which now all three of my daughters have worn this headband for their first Christmas so that's pretty exciting okay I've been cleaning so I look a little nuts but I also want to find a cute outfit for me to wear for Santa photos the past like two like 2018 2019 my now five-year-old both those years she was afraid of Santa so we did instead of just putting the kids on his lap and like having her freak out because I don't want to like put her through that um, I know some people like like those photos of their kids crying with Santa. I personally, that's not for us. Um, so what we did those years is instead of having a picture of just the kids with Santa, is we did a big family photo with Santa. But both of those years, I wasn't like prepared to do a family photo with Santa. So I don't look great in those photos. My kids look so cute and put together. And then my husband and I are just like in casual clothes. But I think this year I'm just gonna go ahead and prepare for a family photo. I still need to find something to wear. Um, Cause I feel like all of my Christmas stuff is either super dressy or super casual. So I might just wear like a nice t-shirt and jeans or something. But as soon as I find it, I will share with you guys. Also, um, we're keeping Christmas dinner like really, really easy, chill, casual this year. But I did get these for the kids and also for my husband and I, but mostly for the kids. I got them the sparkly red grape. Actually, white grape is my favorite, but I don't know. I was kind of like just feeling the red grape this time. Um, and then I haven't tried this one yet, the sparkling strawberry daiquiri. So, um limited edition I can swear that I see this around all the time I don't know maybe it is only out for like the holidays then because I only really look at sparkling juices around the holidays that's the only time I really shop for them but I could have sworn that this is out all the time um, but yeah I got those for to go with Christmas dinner okay my mirror is like so dirty but here is my outfit for Christmas photos. So this shirt is from um, Pink Blush Maternity. It is a maternity top. It has like these ruffle sleeves though. And it also does tie at the bottom, but I tucked the tie in just because I wanted to wear the belt and the belt with the tie was just like, it was too much going on in this area. So I tucked the tie in. Um, I have this belt 
Oh my gosh, the, the mirror is like really bothering me right now. Um, the belt is from Sheen. It's just, it's basic. Everyone has one. Pants from Luva Mia, which I have a haul, um, a try on haul. Um, I'll link it down below if I remember. If I don't remember, just comment and remind me. Um, but pants from Luva Mia. And then right now I just have my pillow slides on, but I am going to wear these boots. Um, I'm not going to put them on before we leave though. I love these boots. My husband got them from like, when we lived in Seattle, he got them from a local department store for me for Black Friday. Have I told that story lately? Um, it's been a few years since I told that story, but a few years ago, like literally five years ago, um, every time we'd go to this department store, I would see these boots. I loved them. I saw an ad that they were on sale um, on Black Friday, but I was going to be out of town. Um, but my husband had to work on Black Friday, but during his break at work, he went to the store and he got them for me. So truly one of my favorite boots, not only because they're cute, but because they have like a cute story behind them. So um, I don't wear them often though, because you know, they are kind of like gaudy, but um, I am gonna wear them today. And then for jewelry, I have my pearlery earrings and necklace that I shared. Um, earlier in the vlog and then I just put this like butterfly clip in um because my hair I just I never really part my hair I kind of just let the part fall wherever it falls and this is where it fell today so since this strand is like not matching up with the rest I put a clip in but yeah we are doing Santa photos today and that is what I am wearing I don't really not super holiday-ish I don't really match the kids but it's fine also, the dress and leggings from Children's Place that I got my daughter for her birthday just came in like a month later. It wasn't Children's Place fault though, like they shipped at a normal time. Um, they were, it was a post office issue. Like I kept checking the tracking and they were stuck in the same place for like two weeks. Um, but it finally came in. So here's the dress. I'm just going to give it to her. Um, I thought of like maybe wrapping it and like give it to her as an extra Christmas present, but I'm just going to give it to her. Look how beautiful this is though. I love these flowers and then some matching pink leggings to go with it. Cute. Okay, super quick jewelry haul. Um, these are all gonna be gifts, but how cool is this? Like a little um, rib cage necklace. I love these ones. They're um, like make a wish. Put on this jewelry and make a wish when the chain has worn through. Legend says your wish will come true. So here's a pink one and then I have this same one in black. Um, oh, it's flipped. And they're like crystals. Cute. This one is kind of like almost that same style. You have a piece of my heart. Um, and then... This one's kind of hard to see, but it's mushrooms and a moon. Um, this one's a little kitty cat. And then the last one is, this is for uh, one of my sisters and it's her birth year. So yeah, I need to wrap all of this. Hi everyone, so it's Christmas Eve and I did my 5K today. I've got my shirt on. Um, I already like put the runner's badge and medal and stuff away. Um, I finished about an hour ago. It was okay, it was so windy outside. I had to walk most of it cause I was like walking against the wind for about half of it. Um, so that was hard, um, but it went okay. I definitely wanna do another one and like train and be better prepared. But um, my husband's Dr. Squatch order just came in. If you saw my what I got my husband for Christmas, I wasn't sure if it was gonna come in on time for Christmas. Let me show you because the packaging is so good on this. All right, so here it is. Um, just for reference, this is how a normal soap comes packaged. Like I ordered three normal soaps for his stocking. Th there's those. And then here's the Star Wars set. How do I even open this? I totally thought I was filming this entire time. It wasn't, but it opens up like a magnet like this. This is so nice. So here's the top part, it has some like art, and then these are the four soaps that come with it. Only Hope Soap with Bentonite Clay, Wisdom Wash with Lotus Leaf, the Dark Side Scrub, which Sand, Heavy Grit, 
roofless rinse black sand so these two are like scrubs and these two are like soaps how cool is this and then this thing is like a little ripped right here but you can take this out it's just like to hold the soaps in oh my gosh i did not even notice that okay that's cool then you can take this out and then it's just like a box that you can keep and put stuff in and it's a really good like quality box that's cool jedi master yoda sith lord darth vader has like their weapons right i'm not a huge star wars fan and sith warrior darth maul that's pretty cool Good morning, everyone. Merry Christmas. I thought I'd do a little quick what I got for Christmas. But my husband did get me this ring light, which I'm so excited about. Um, currently, I use like umbrella lights for videos, and I've had them for a few years now. And actually, they're pretty like broken up and beat up and stuff. And so, this is much needed. And then, um, I'm not going to share like money and gift cards and stuff. First, look how cute this bag is. This sparkly Santa. I love it. You guys know I love all the sparkly glittery things. But my mom did get me a Yeti. So I'm excited to use this. And how pretty is that color? And then she also got me um, this candle. Um from Bath and Body Works, the Black Cherry Merlot. Oh, this smells so good. I love cherry, cherry things. Like with candy and stuff even, like cherry flavored candies are my favorite. Oh, and this, that's what this smells like, is cherry flavored candy. So I don't even wanna burn it because it's like, it smells so good. I just wanna like keep it on my vanity forever. Um, so there is that. We already did presents and breakfast and everything, and now we're all just chilling out. Kids are playing with their new toys. And then tonight we're doing Christmas dinner. I'm actually, I'm just gonna include a clip of Christmas dinner right here. We're just doing ham, mac and cheese, mashed potatoes, green beans, um, rolls, and then just Christmas cookies for dessert. But um, yeah, that's it for today's vlog. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.